lose yourself. There are more to your life than where you are now. Your mind is a great tool. It's a powerful tool. And your mind is like a magnet. Wherever you place a magnet, it attracts anything still. Whether it's good to eat or not, it will magnet it to bring them close. So your mind is like a river that flows anywhere if it's not controlled. When a man is not properly kept in shape or positioned properly, the mind can flow in any direction. But as a child of God, you can control your mind. You can do something about your mind to bring about change that you're looking for in your life. You need to work on your mind. You need to change the way you behave. Your mind can be your behavior. Your mind can be a very you know, important tool that will aid your progress, whether business, whether marriage, whether ministry, whether relationship. You need to work on your mind. Your mind is your environment. The way you see people is the way you are. Your mindset will always culminate into your life set. The set of your life is the function of the set of your mind. You are not poor because you lack resources. You are poor because your mind is poor. Enrich your mind. You are not who you are today because you choose it. You are who you are because your mind chose it. So you need to work on your mind. You have a bad relationship because you have a bad mindset.